What's up, guys? It is the Black Man 1467 here, and uh, I got another huge update slash more questions that people want to know. So I think this video is pretty much going to be used for that. So uh, just throw some super stark why answer some questions. We'll start with the first one. You and Dark Luigi games seem to have a very good Evil Donald game. If y'all two face each other, who do you think will win? That's a tough question. As Dark Luigi and I have two different playing styles, so basically, he, and when it comes to combos, I think he will probably edge me on that because he does have a better air game than I do. But I, I think personally, I probably have a better ground, a better ground game than him. But if I have to be honest, Dark Luigi knows how to keep you in the air for a long time. So if he keeps you in the air, you're pretty much done. So I think I have to give the edge to him. But it'd be a good master. I think it would go to round three. Let's see. Da -da 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 -da. Let's see. Okay. Out of all the people you play in Mario Kart, who's your favorite? It depends on the game. If you talk about Mario Kart Wii, I always use Waluigi. All the time. Waluigi's my favorite. Then it'd be Luigi. Da -da 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 -da. I see you play as Donald a lot. Does anybody else you play with? Oh my goodness, either way. Uh, let's see. Well, when I first played Luigi, I used to have a really good DB call game. But I just kind of dropped him for some reason. I used to have a really good DB call game, and I just don't know what happened. And also, I had a really good Warner's Luigi's game. But, uh,. I just kind of dropped him too, and now I played as him like a couple months ago. It felt so awkward because I've been used to playing with Donald all the time. It just felt too awkward to me, so I couldn't do it anymore. <sighs> Let's see. Who, what, which game is your favorite Mario Kart? Uh, this one in Mario Kart 64 is my two favorite Mario Karts. Out of all of them, these two are my favorite. What's your least favorite Mario Kart? Mario Kart 7. I, I, I despise Mario Kart 7. I think that's like the slowest Mario Kart I ever felt in my life. Do you ever plan to making a Mewjing group just for the all like streaming and Skype calls? Uh, I never really thought about that. Maybe for a few people out of... Well, I mean, I have, I have Stargazer on Skype, so... But I haven't talked to him in quite some time, though. So I have to really talk to him again. Da -da. Besides your channel, your besides ah, oh, st sorry, I read the question wrong. Besides Stargazer's Legion channel, your channel is pretty much my other favorite. Oh, thank you, dude. I appreciate it. Try my best to appease the fans. Da -da 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 -da. What's your favorite track in Mario Kart Super Circuit? Cheeseland, hands down. Cheeseland. So Cheese Line is the best track in the game. That needs to be remade, by the way. Okay, what else? What else? Least favorite Mugen character? Mm -hmm. Oh, wow. That's, uh, that's pretty tough. I, I don't know what to say. My least favorite Mugen character so far? I don't have one. Are you got, do you plan on making more videos of you fighting characters? Uh, believe it or not, the last two days I've been really in the mood to play some Mugen, so I have and recorded just about every match of it. So basically I have a lot of matches that's on my computer right now that I just haven't uploaded yet. So I plan to upload a lot of those, probably every single one. So that'd be great to see. Some, some I win, some I lose. So and pretty much I'm all using Donald's. So it's okay. Hmm. Do you like Colonel Sanders as a Mugen character? Yes, he's very well made. He's difficult, but he's, he's good. Maybe I might try to pick him up. See if he's as easy as Donald to pick up. It's it's weird to me. Super Mario and Super Luigi, are, to me, are harder to pick up, or at least harder for me, to pick up as a character and play with than Donald. And Donald's way more complex than the Mario Brothers way more complex. Okay, let's see. Do you have a YouTube channel that you don't like? 
Uh, I'm not gonna be mean and say that. I mean, I, I'm not, I don't like really putting people on blast, especially on YouTube. That's just not me. So I don't keep my mouth shut. It, how do you feel about your subscribers? Uh, do you mean like specific or in general? I mean in general, I pretty much like every one of them, although I haven't talked to like a lot of them. I talked to a few of them. Uh, I mean, I'm, I'm just happy they subscribed to me in the first place, so I can't really complain about anything. Do you think Mewjin will last next year? Mm, I think so. I think Mewjin will last a little while. I know last lay uh, last update I know, uh, I've been saying I've been pretty bored with it. I mean, but it's gonna last for a while. It does it does big things for my channel, so I'm not gonna put something away that really helps my channel a lot. So yeah, Mewjin's staying for for some time. When are you gonna upload some more Smash Bros? You promised me more Smash Bros. Oh, I'm uploading Smash Bros on Christmas Day, dude. So don't worry. Christmas Day, you're gonna see some Smash Bros. Oh, I wanna wish you happy holidays and Merry Christmas and Happy New Year. Hey, I appreciate it. Same to you, dude. Same to you. Hmm, let's see. Another question. Do you like Yoshi? Yes, I do like Yoshi. In general, Yes, and the Mijin character, I like Yoshi as a Mijin character too. Let's see. Do you like Super Mario and Super Luigi as a Mijin character? Yes, yes I do. Do you think Jack Ball Z characters could be better in Mijin if they didn't have to always focus on charging their power? I mean, they're great characters in general, but... Uh, some characters have AI patch, like, I know Vegeta and Goku have AI patch, and they're really tough to beat with the AI patch, for sure. But yeah, I mean, it's great. Right, so, going back to the question of Deep Cut, what is the difference between your Evil Donald game, uh, excuse me guys, I'm sorry, your Evil Donald game and Dark Luigi's Evil Donald game? Okay, Evil Donald, I mean, excuse me, Dark Luigi games, Evil Donald, I mean, the way he plays Evil Donald, it's a, quite a bit different. See, me, I'm more of a ground game guy, especially with Evil Donald. I mean, if I keep you on the ground and keep stunning you, you're pretty much done. And I pretty much know all the Don Evil Donald's moves by the back of my head, like, no problem. But I think Evil Donald, I mean, Dark Luigi game, he, like I said, he has probably... A, bit, a way better air game than I do for sure. So basically, it's more like this. And if I get trapped in the air, I'm pretty much done for. Uh, luckily, I know some ways to get out of that. Simple. One way to get out of that: throw the apple bomb in the air. It might pop people down on the head. It might stun them a bit, but you don't have much time to get back in it. You know, throw some French fries. The things I like to do. I like to do the little little slide kick and then the french fry barrage stuns them maybe throw an apple bomb gives me a chance to throw an apple bomb and then maybe the lead stance move that's what I always like to do a lot but uh, I think he would probably beat me to be honest I'll be completely honest he'll probably beat me hmm <laughs> Oh, let's see. Da, 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 da. Which of, out of all these Donald edits, which one's your favorite? Donald SE, Donald SE2, DD1, or Classic Donald? Hmm, that's pretty hard. There's a lot of things. There's certain aspects to each Donald that I really do like. Uh, I would have to go with Donald. Donald SC2. It's my favorite of the four, but I really like all of them. I like all the Donalds, if you want my honesty. Man, where do you find all these cool, rare edits? Like, this, this edits you can't find these days. You know what, I... I get really bored, and I just search up Mewjin characters, I just somehow find them. It's, it's just crazy, huh? 
Uh, do you share Mugen characters? Depends who you are. It depends who you are that I share Mugen characters. I have to know you well enough, or you have to support my channel well enough that I really have no problem giving you Mugen characters whatsoever. What's what? What's the, the character you just last put in your roster, like as in an update? I put it in another Donald, Supreme Donald, a few days ago, uh, in the Holy Akuma. But before that, I haven't updated my roster in a long, long time. Like it's been a long time. Like you don't even know. Are you gonna play? Did you, did you ever get the DLC for Mario Kart 8? No, surprisingly, I didn't. I I, sh I really should though. I really should get that update. I should have saved that red shell too. Oh, yes, I. That's not helpful. Oh, they missed me too. <laughs> yeah. Uh, do you like Princess Peach as a mutant character? I have two peaches and like one better than the other. But as a regular character, no, I despise Peach. Like entirely. More than I hate Peach more than Daisy, and that's that's something because Daisy's really annoying. But whatever. You do you like Doctor Doom as a Mugen character? Yes, I do. He's one of my favorites. Uh Which side do you like more, holy or evil? So that's weird. See, it's ironic. I have holy Akuma, holy, holy Ryu, and holy Ken. Why well, have evil Ken, evil Ryu, and then regular Akuma, which is in general evil? Uh, they're all really great characters, but I always like the holies better than the evils. Although I'm not gonna lie, the holies are a bit OP. I will not lie. But I always did like the holy better than the evils. Not to knock off the evils though. Okay. If they put Cheese Land in the second DLC pack, would you buy it? Absolutely. Absolutely. If I see Cheese Land on DLC pack number two for Mario Kart 8, that is an instant buy for me because Cheese Land is amazing. Like, you, you cannot not, you can't not like Cheese Land. What's up? Hey, I'm thinking, any ideas for a Mugen character? Yes, I got a bunch of ideas. If you need ideas, you let me know because I have a bunch. Right. Either way, oh wait, before that, I need to go back to a question. I did actually add a lot more characters. I just thought we got a bunch of Street Fighter 2 characters. I added Raging Ken, Sensei Ken, Dragon Ryu, Shin Ryu. Oh, I added a lot of characters. I can't believe I forgot. Rainbow Clown, which is a ch very cheap Donald edit. Uh, Shin Ryu, bunch of new, bunch of another new Akuma. I added a bunch of things. Either way, let's go back to my the other question. Sorry, I added, I added a lot of characters. Um, ideas for Mugen. Yes, 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 yes. Right. Ideas for Mugen characters. Uh, if you need an idea, like, you know what, since, since you already have an evil Donald, do a holy Donald, like, that would have been awesome. Although, generally, I guess Donald versus Evil Donald's kind of like that. But still, it would be nice to see, like, you know, Holy Ken versus Evil Ken. Hol Holy Ryu versus Evil Ryu. We also need a Holy Dan. We need a Holy Dan. We already got a... We even have a Holy Akuma, man. We need... We need a... a and we need a, an Evil... A Light... A Holy Donald. Even a... And we even got Dark Chun-Li. We need a Light Chun-Li. A Holy Chun-Li. Something. Make a special edits or anything, that'd be awesome. Do you like Cinerooms edits and work? Yes, I do. 
I think Senaru has some great things going for him, and plus, he's making the new Donald right now that's kind of based off POTS, which I think will be interesting, not definitely a get for me when it comes out. Oh, no! No! Yeah, okay, that's good, that's not bad. Oh, I can't believe I messed that up. Hit of a thwomp. At least the green shell came back to her toe, so I'm not mad. Maybe we do another Grand Prix, that'd be nice. Uh, so by the way, how do you feel about Dark Luigi's game's creation? I think it's very nice. I think... Oh, come on, emulator, for real. I think... My personal opinions. I think the great thing is going for him. Uh, do I know what the next creation is going to be? I don't know. But I know when it comes out, I'm going to get it. For sure. I, I think all his creations are very great. I love all of them. He has things going for him. He can be an all-time great for Mugen, to be honest. The way he's going. Like seeing Punk as a Mugen character? Yes, I do. Although, he's very easy to beat these days. Oh no. Where did you find Dark Sean? <laughs> to be honest, dude, I don't even remember where I found like half of these characters alone. And I was like, after my first computer car, I didn't even had a lot more rare characters than my other medium before it crashed. Like back in the summer. And I had a lot of rare characters. I don't remember where I find all these anymore. Which is sad because I do miss some of these characters, but I'm not mad anymore. I probably forgot what the names are. Why do you not like small characters? Okay. That is a very good question. It's not because the characters are bad, okay? All because I don't like them because they're small doesn't mean I think they're bad. It's a matter of fact that Nova characters can't really hit them at all. Therefore, he, they're gonna pretty much win unless it's going to a super cheap character like, you know, Dark Donald, Rare Puma, etc. Normal characters won't be able to do any combos on them. Therefore, that's why I don't like small characters. Like, I can take care. I like characters, you know, Super Mario's height and taller. Okay, I can take that because Mario act he actually has some pretty big hitbox. Hitboxes, actually. But. But, you know, guys like Hawkeye, uh, who else, who else, can I think? What, oh, what is their name, what are the names of the names? Excuse me, I gotta think of the names, I surely can't remember the names. Uh, yeah, I can't remember, I have to get back to you, because I can't remember the names, I'm a little tired. And I still got a lot more questions to go. What do you use to record? Bandicam and XSplit. That's what I use. XSplit for longer stuff. Because I have a limited recording time on XSplit. If you're wondering. Who's your most supportive subscriber? Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> That's hard to say. I got a few that's very supportive. Uh, I'd say definitely Dark Luigi Games, Mutant Hip Hop. Uh, hmm, Rent can be pretty supportive at times. Star Gazer is pretty supportive. Uh, I feel like I'm missing somebody else. Uh, I'm, I'm missing somebody else. But I can't, I can't remember the name. I really can't. I can't remember. Not saying I don't want to forget. I think that's just about it. Oh, voice scrub rocks. In. Do you have any artists or Mugen creators that's actually subscribed to you? Uh, I actually got a couple, believe it or not. I got, of course, Dark Luigi Games, Hey Eight Dave Six O Six, which is basically the creator of Ultimate Donald. Uh, voice scrub rocks. I mean, you know, he subscribed to me. Uh. I know this one, but I know he's not as known, but he's a creator that can be. He subscribed to me as well. 
those cre those creators are subscribed to me. Uh, believe it or not, which is awesome that I have like creators, meeting creators that actually subscribe to my channel. I think that's awesome. Uh, da -da 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 -da. Any decently famous subscribers that are actually subscribed to you? Uh, da -da -da -da. Well, I have, let's see, of course, Heyete606, he has over a thousand. Mutant Hip Hop has over a thousand. Uh, there's another one that's really close to a thousand. But I cannot remember the name. I got a few people that's pretty high up there when it comes to subscribers that are pretty much way above me that subscribe to me, which is awesome. You know what? I'm gonna do it. I'm, I think I should. I'm probably gonna create a Mewjing group for Skype. So, if, if you want to know more about it, just ask me below. I think I should do it. It'd be interesting to discuss Mewjing over Skype or something. Trade characters and whatever. I have no problem doing it. Oh my goodness. Okay. Do you like Bowser as a Mewtwo character? Yes, I do. I do. Kimmich? Yes, I do. Uh, Donkey Kongs? You know, I'm surprised there's not a lot of good Donkey Kongs out there. I mean, they made every every character possible except a good Donkey Kong. I mean, there's one huge Donkey Kong that's like a very long span. A lot of arm span. That pretty much can beat you up in like 10 seconds flat. honest, I'm probably going to do one more Grand Prix, then that'll be it for this video. Depends how I feel, actually. Did Luigi just disappear on me? Oh, he got a ghost. No wonder. I'm helping you out, Luigi. Oh, he, just, he did it. He had a two? He did it. I'm setting Luigi up for success. Come on, Luigi. It's all up to you, dude. Luigi. Come on, bro. Luigi, bro, I set you up for success. Oops. I've set Luigi up for success, and he failed. That was his. That was his getaway. <sighs> Luigi, come on, bro. For real. That was your success, and you failed. Okay. Yeah, that's it, me giant this. Do a holy Donald, holy Chun Li. Easily do that. Um, that's another famous fast food restaurant you can go off with. You make a good Burger King guy. Like for real, there's no good Burger King guy. You should make a Burger King. Just ideas, but you do what you want. I don't care. You're the creator. I don't create music characters. Oh, wait, ironically, that's the next question. What happened to you talk about making a Mewjin creation? It's too hard. I don't understand. It, it boggles my mind. I can't do it. I tried. Too confusing. So I didn't... I just stopped in general. I'm not gonna... Oh. I'm not gonna even bother with it anymore. I, I give up, though. I gave up on it. Too hard. How's the Mewjin Showdown series going? That's going pretty well. I just opened uh I just uploaded season two episode two like a couple days ago. Oh a couple days ago, believe it or not. What's 
save you, Luigi. I'll save you. That's a danky Kong gets. I, I secured Luigi a, a second place. Go, Luigi! I saved you! Oh, wait, I have to restart this. It's just, oh, I gotta hurry up. Yeah! <laughs> Luigi got first? Yes! Ah, warms my heart when Luigi does well. Yoshi only got four points? I swore I thought Yoshi did better than what he did. Not complaining. One star! I'm not gonna even go there. Let's do one more track, one more Grand Prix, because I got some more questions. I have a lot of more questions. Oh gosh. Oh, this emulator, dude! Let's just reset the emulator. We'll go. I think we'll go with Mario again. Hmm. Hmm. We'll go with this one. Just because that's Ribbon Road. Right. So, how long have you been doing Mugen? A uh, little over a year. About a year and a month. Do you consider ever taking creations, like giving you an honest opinions. I always do that. If you want an opinion, you gotta let me know. If you want me to try a character, you gotta let me know. Okay. Yeah, right, here's some honesty here. Why do you not take links for other characters in tournaments? That's a good question. It's because I've got over 500 characters, and possibly the links you give me, once the, you know, ugh. Once you basically give me the characters, it might be a character I'm probably not going to want later on in my roster, and, I don't, and I'm probably going to forget to get rid of it as well, to be honest. And plus, i got over 500 characters to choose, so I have a lot of variety. It's your fault that you chose clones as a team. I didn't tell you to pick those four characters. Out of 500, you basically chose four clones. That's your fault. Sorry. I don't feel like adding characters that I really don't want. When it comes to accepting characters in general, not tournaments, why do you, it seems that you only accept characters when it's only a Mario Donald? That's not necessarily true. Because a lot of links that people give me. It's characters I will already have, if you if you see my point. It's characters that I already have. So basically if unless it's some improvement or a huge update, I really have I have no point to taking it because I already have the character. It's not that I don't want to accept it, it's because I already have a character in my roster. Like I said, unless it's an update or a major bug fixed or something, I have no point to taking it, because I already have it. Not because I just taken a Donald because I want it, because although Donalds are awesome and the more Donalds the better, and the more Mario's the better, I have, well, trust me, I probably have a lot of Donalds, don't get me wrong, because Donalds are awesome, but hey, you know, it is what it is. Whoops. Why do you not like uh, da -da 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 -da, My Little Pony characters? I hope you're not really a brony asking me this. It's not the fact I hate people that like My Little Pony. I can care less that you like My Little Pony. I, I really don't care if you. I don't care if you watch the show. I, I don't care if you like the characters. If you like My Little Pony characters and want them in your Mugen roster, be my guest. I don't care. It's your Mugen game, your laptop, you're downloading it, you're risking a virus, whatever. I don't I don't care. It's your roster. Put whoever you want on it. But and did I say and two, I never said the characters were bad. I'm just not a big fan of my love pony. 
I'm just not. That's just not me. But I, I don't bully people that do like My Little Pony, if you get what I'm saying. I don't bully people that like My Little Pony. Let's, let's get that straight. If you think I bully people because they like My Little Pony, I, I really don't. Oh, goodness. I absolutely don't bully people with the likes of My Little Pony. That's just not my thing. Like I'm gonna say, if you like it, be my guest. Do whatever you want. Add whoever you want to me to roster. But I don't have to like My Little Pony characters. If, look, like I said, my last FAQ. If the character's good, I'm gonna put him on my roster. If, I, if the character wasn't good, do you think I would have it of My Little Pony characters on my roster right now? If they weren't good. Okay, my point. There you go. Oh man, that, 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 that. It was, what was that a question? I can't remember. Maybe I should have <coughs> rolled all these in notepads. Whatever. Let's see. What was the darn question? Can't remember. Oh well. Oh, okay. So, why do you not like My Little Pony then? Ugh. It's just something I never cared about. Don't watch it. Don't play as My Little Pony characters. Just not my thing. Just respect that please, because I don't hate people that do like My Little Pony. I don't. Like I said, all because I don't like it, doesn't mean I hate people that do. But you always cheer against them. Well, yeah, because they're always facing a Donald all the time. Every Red Legion battle, I see a pony that always facing a Donald. So I'm obviously, you know, Donalds are my favorites. So I'm going to cheer for the Donalds over the ponies any day. Come on, you guys. Especially if you know I've been doing Legion for a year. You know I like the Donalds are one of my favorites. Obviously, I'm going to cheer against anybody, pretty much, that's going against the Donald. I really, your Beecher Showdown roster is quite the weird one. You have, although you have the varieties, almost seems kind of unbalanced. That's not necessarily true. The character that I added is for a certain reason. I was thinking about adding Holy Ken, but I didn't because I know his specials are super OP. Think about it. Captain Ginyu? Yeah, probably a lot of people don't even know about Captain Ginyu. I like Super Goku. Don't get me wrong, he did okay in the last season. And I pretty much I know who should just hit somebody I don't know who. I like Captain Ginyu, but uh he's super Goku. But he's not aggressive as Captain Ginyu, believe it or not. He's uh, Captain Ginyu is actually a lot more aggressive than Super Goku. And one of my very old region battles says Super Goku versus Captain Ginyu. Captain Ginyu destroyed Super Goku both rounds. Easily. Captain Ginyu's the better guy. Why did you add Green Lantern? I feel like he's a pretty lame character. Ouch. <laughs> That's okay, I didn't make him. Uh, I just thought he was a great fit, and you know... And I, I, it was, he was basically the last character I chose. Uh, I didn't know who really, really who to choose at the time. I was just searching around my roster thinking who would be good. I was thinking about Dragon Claw, but I said, nah, it's not... Dragon Claw wouldn't be a good fit. Uh, I was like, hmm... I'd love to add Guile, but I don't want any more Street Fighter characters reps. I don't want any street, too much Street Fighter reps in there. Uh, Bowser, no, definitely he'll destroy everybody. I was like, hmm, hmm, hmm. I could use another DC rep. Although, uh, although that Joker is my favorite version of the Joker, his AI is not good at all. Oh, Dark Luigi, by the way, you should, you should edit that Joker to make him more aggressive. Since the creator is basically retired from Eugen, you should you should edit that Joker. You should edit that Joker. I'm serious. You should edit that Joker. Cause that that Joker, I think out of all the Joker that uh, Joker has made, that's the best Joker with the most moves. It's just his AI is just not that great. Oh shoot, I didn't mean to hit the hot button. Honestly. 
quite honestly though, but that's just me. Uh, why, did, why didn't Ryu and Ken show back up? Because they did terrible. No offense. I like, I like Ryu and Ken. I really do. Especially the, the version that had from Niji Showdown. Personally, I did. I do miss them. Uh, I love Infinite's versions of Ryu and Ken. I think personally they're the best. Uh, um, but they just couldn't get any wins, really. Ryu, I think he got like three or four wins, and Ken got like one or two, which is terrible. But you know, I do like him. So, but uh, honestly, I just gotta say that you never know. Maybe if I put a different version of them. But. I don't know what to say, basically. I, I have to say, they did better to be in this season, too, but they didn't. See, I'm surprised you put Evil Dan and Dark Chun Lee in there. Uh, Evil Dan, he's beatable. You mean, is he better than Evil Ryu? Ah, uh, that's my personal opinion, and I say yes. But, he's beatable. I beat Evil Dan before, therefore, he definitely did too. Uh, I got three more questions. Okay. Oh yeah, I never finished a Green Lantern. I just thought Green Lantern was a good fit. I think he'll do well. Uh, actually, he'll do okay. I think he'll do okay. There's my, there's my answer. He'll, he'll do okay. He'll do okay. Uh, why did you let Wonder Woman back in? She didn't do that well. I felt that Wonder Woman is a just perfect fit for the show. I know she can do better, and she had five wins, so... I think she she could have done great as well. She, I gave her another chance. I mean, she, she's one of the people who actually really deserved another chance. Competitive, you know, like people like CM Punk, Ryu, Ken, that weren't going to go anywhere. And this roster is even tougher than the last one, so they weren't going to go anywhere. They might have beat they might have beat Shaq out of all characters. They might have beat Shaq, maybe Green Lantern as well. But that's just about it. They will lose to the Mario Bros, Dark Chun Li, Evil Dan, Doctor Doom. They they would have lost to them. And Captain Ginyu, they would lost to them too. So that's why they put they might get a win or two, but that's it. Probably get the same record. Uh, da, 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 da. Are you gonna continue fighting random characters? Of course I will, since I have like over 20 battles recorded. Uh, that's pretty much all I got. So, thank you for the questions. If you have any more questions, let me know. I'll put it in the next video. Until then, see you later.